A very good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Kriya, and I will be your master of ceremony for tonight. A warm welcome to our dear students, parents, and staff of Kingston International College. Tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we are all here to witness the achievement of our students of Kingston International College, Singapore. Graduation day is the culmination of all the hard work and a year of study. It is the day when students can finally say, I have done it. Tonight, ladies and gentlemen, marks another milestone in the history of Kingston International College. As we gather and celebrate the success of our students who have successfully completed their Diploma in Business and Sales Management and Postgraduate Diploma in Business Management. To our graduating class, today is your graduation after your successful completion of a course of study with us at Kingston International College. Now, ladies and gentlemen, let's look at our agenda for tonight. This qualification through your commitment to study and perseverance in pursuing additional education. This graduation should signify a cementing of knowledge and achievement and nobody can take away your education. I now invite the principal of Kingston International College, Miss Noura, to formally open this graduation's proceedings. Thank you, Ms. Kriya. Thank you, Ms. Kriya. Good evening, guests, graduates, ladies and gentlemen. It is my sincere honor tonight to deliver the welcome address for this special online graduation ceremony for the Diploma in Business and Sales Management, e-learning, as well as the Postgraduate Diploma in Business Management, e-learning at Kingston International College. It is my pleasure to welcome our graduates, their families and friends, and the faculty to our online graduation ceremony. Tonight, we celebrate the success of our 68 graduates who had persevered almost a year of hard work, sleepless nights and juggling work with studies and family commitments. Our online program introduced during the pandemic periods was to reach out to keen learners around the world and to encourage and develop lifelong learning. Now, we hope our programs change our learners' lives for the better through the knowledge that you have acquired and through the friendships and connections that you have made. All our graduates have incredibly displayed the adaptability and perseverance. 
Kingston is very proud of the achievement that you have accomplished with the opportunities that you were offered. This is not the end, graduates. It is a new beginning of something that will lead you to your next success. Let us now also appreciate those who have supported you through this journey. Your lecturers, staff and consultants in the school, your course mates who brave through the hours of learning with you, family members and friends who still are present today to celebrate this day with you. To all our graduates tonight, be proud of this moment and know that you deserve all the successes that you have worked hard for. My warmest congratulations again to you on completing another important milestone in your learning journey. Thank you. Ms. Kriya. Thank you, Ms. Noura. In the words of Martin Luther King Jr., intelligence plus character, that is the goal of true education. Next, ladies and gentlemen, let us move to the honor roll for our graduating class today. I now invite Ms. Sheena to read the honor roll for tonight's graduation. Good evening, everyone. I will now read the list of our graduating class today in alphabetical order. Diploma in Business and Sales Management. Lee T. Toyet. My. And that completes the list of our graduating students for Diploma in Business and Sales Management. Thank you and congratulations. I will now read the list of our graduating class today for postgraduate Diploma in Business and Management. Alfred Briones Canicosa. Almendral Jesusito San Pedro. Amira Ulalung Basman. Anisor Raman. Ao T. Huang Wan. Byron Rueda Mirano. Dai Valentinino Janetra Stalin. Dang P. Lin Chi. Du An Tuan. Estefani Apostol. Frances Udinaka Obawoiki. Nin A. Kain. Wang Min Tam. Wang P. Long. Hong Yen Li. Kalamkas Abdi Karimova. Kalifili Sibanda. La Man Lin. Li Ti Big Hua. Li Ti Min Tap. Li Ti Ngoyet Min. Laurelyn Villanueva Pine. Lo Kok Tai. Mariam Bin Abda. Mercilita Vibar Escudero. Michael Adje. Mohalifa James Putihang. Muhammad Iqbal Hussein Tudori. Muhammad Usman Rana. Nan April Mien. 
Natalie Jacob. Ngo T. Coin Chok. Nguyen Kong Tien. Nguyen Dang Hong Tak. Nguyen Dok Pong. Nguyen Pam Toi Dong. Nguyen Tam An. Nguyen T. Big Chow. Nguyen T. Hong Duk. Nguyen T. Hong Nok. Nguyen T. Kan Hong. Nguyen T. Ngan. Nguyen T. Ngok Tren. Nguyen T. Tan Hua. Nguyen Toyet No. Nen Ngo Men Ngo. Numita Joy Suetos. Wan Nguyen Ti. Peter Paul Villadores La Jahali. Pam Kyo Wan. Pam Ti Tam Hong. Pam Tan Tao. Region May Jacinto Ribolio. Shakil or Raman. Sona Tonita. Tinakaran Seloven. Tu Zar Quinn. Tu Sara Utpala Wick Ramage. Tran Kim Pong. Tran T. Kyo Ngok. Tran T. Mi Duyen. Tran Toy Bao Chan. Tran Ban Choyen. Bandinata Tao. Bo Huang Pong Tao. Bo Kuk Hong. Bo Ti Huai Li. And that completes the list of our graduating students for postgraduate diploma in business and a business management. Thank you and congratulations. Thank you, Ms. Gina. Let us now move on to the next agenda for tonight's graduation, recognizing our valedictorians.
ladies and gentlemen, we will now recognize six students having achieved the highest rank in today's graduating class for postgraduate diploma in business management. To our valedictorians, your hard work, your resilience, and your determination have brought you to this moment. So today, your addresses should inspire you and this graduating class to reflect your sense of consciousness and maturity. Congratulations to all our valedictorians. Now, let us call on our valedictorians to deliver their valedictory addresses. Ms. Sheena? Okay, thank you, Priya. I will now read the list of our valedictorians in alphabetical order. Postgraduate Diploma in Business Management. Dai Valentinino Hanetra Salim. Lu Kok Tai. Muhammad Osman Rana. Nguyen T. Ngok Trin. Tenakaran Selovin. And Tran D. Mi Doyen. I will now invite Dai Valentinino Hanetra Salim to give their speech. So thank you for the time. So let me start my speech for dear Professor Kues and my fellow graduates from Kingston International College. As Nelson Mandela once said, education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. This quote encapsulates the essence of our journey at Kingston International College. Education has empowered us, and as we step into the world, let's will this power to bring about positive change, to innovate, and to inspire. Today, as we stand here on the brink of our graduation, I feel honored to share this moment with each one of you. I want to express my heartfelt gratitude to our professor and teachers whose guidance has shaped our academic journey and to our friends who unvarying support has made this year unforgettable. Our time at Kingston International College has been a transformative experience. Every lecture, every project and every late night study session has been a stepping stone in our growth. We have not only gained knowledge, but forget lasting friendship, overcome challenge and discover our strength together. As graduates of Kingston International College, we represent a diverse tapestry of talents and aspirations. Our field of study may differ, but our collective potential to bring about positive change unite us. Whether we, whether we chart our path in engineering, the arts, science, and entrepreneurship, we carry the responsibility to use our skills for the betterment of our communities and the world at large. Let's take a moment to, to appreciate the professor and the teachers at Kingston International College, whose wisdom has illuminated our path. Their dedication and support have been instrumental in our success. And let's not forget our families and friends who love and encouragement has been the bedrock of our achievement. Now, as we prepare the step beyond the walls, let's carry forward the lesson. Kingston International School has taught us more than just the textbook knowledge. We have learned adaptability and the importance of determination. Let's embrace to uncertainty of the future with courage, knowing that we are equipped to face them head on. Let's chase our dreams passionately with kindness in our heart and and the pursuit of the excellence. This day marks not just an end, but the beginning of a new chapter in our life. Filled with the endless, endless possibilities, Kingston International College has been our nurturing ground, shaping us into capable individuals. And today, we celebrate not just our individual achievement, but also the collective success of our class. 
So congratulations to each of us for reaching this milestone as we step out into the world. Let's carry the spirit of Kingston International College with us. Let's use our knowledge, skills, and the experience to make the meaningful contribution to the society. Yeah, the last, in the word of the Maya Angelou, I have learned that people will forget what you said, people will forget what you did, but people will never forget how you make them feel. So as we step forward into new horizons, let us aspire not just to achieve greatness, but to leave an indelible mark through our kindness, empathy, and the positive impact we create in the life of others. So thank you, Kingston International College, for being our academic home. And to my fellow graduates, I wish you all success and fulfillment in your future in those in the efforts. Let's carry the spirit of learning, compassion, and then the perseverance forward as we embark on this new chapter. So thank you, and may success follow each of one of us in our unique path. Thank you so much for your valedictorian speech, Dai Valentinino Hanetra Salim. I will now invite Lu Kok Tai to give their speech. Hi. Hello, Madam Nura. Hello, all the departments who make the events today for all of us. First of all, let me introduce you about myself. My name is Lu Tai. My English name is Julian. Uh, we have officially graduated from Kingston International College with the fourth graduate diploma in business management. I'm honored to represent for all the classmates again, being the most 12 months that we study. To remember this milestone, here are the lessons learned over the past 12 months. Firstly, life and fought over a long period of time, go with the flow. I had hoped to further study for many years, but the opportunity arose only after I meet the right people, benefactors at work, some brilliant students, and professor at Kingston International College. And uh, it's worth the right time and right place to deeply understand and apply what I was learning inside the classroom, outside the classroom as well. Secondly, uh, reality is the process over the results. It took a while to accustom to working and studying at the same time. As you know, working and studying at the same time is very hard for us as well, but we managed to do that. But when we did it, it's worth the love of learning that we make the process so enjoyable. The proper discussion in the class and the group work, the exposure to different classmates and lectures and having insight into the multicultural experience and way of thinking were most valuable than assignment and examination. Intersex uh, interest, interestingly, when I shift my focus from the scoring to experiencing, I was happily placed on the then list. So yes, proceed first, and the result will come later. Thirdly, embrace yourself for who you are and place to your strength. This is not easy. As you know, the Asian parents' job are real. And for a half of my life, I have refused to accept that I am a highly sensitive person. I think and feel deeply. I get over simulated easily and miss a lot of our time as well. Last but not least, I would like to say a big thank you to my benefactors. You know who you are. I have thank you so many times and continue hold the gratitude of my heart. A big thank you for the past and the current company who allow me to study and work and make my life so easier as well. It is true, when you deserve to roll for the benefit of the company, opportunities do arise. A big thank you to my classmate and professor who make the experience so rich. 
And to those who feel a bit different from the rest, just the process and look to your strength. It will work out and your price will be based up. I would like to say a big thank you to Madame Nura who make this journey and education for all of us, is a, which is wonderful for us as well. Thank you. Wish you all the best. Thank you for your valedictorian speech, Lu Hok Tai. I will now invite Muhammad Usman Rana to give their speech. So, um, uh, Muhammad Usman Rana is not able to join us tonight, so we will proceed with the next valedictorian. I will now invite Nguyen T. Ngoc Chin to give their speech. Hi. Hi, teacher. Friends and friends, family. Uh, first of all, I feel very happy and lucky to be here at this moment to express my thoughts. Uh, it's an honor to to be standing before you on such a memorable occasion. I would like to introduce my myself. My name is Chis. I am living and working in coastal city in Vietnam. It's called Da Nang City. My current job is Japanese interpreter and uh, human resources as a uh, Toyota leader. Uh, I, I graduated from uh, in uh, food and nutrition. Uh, when I start working in human resources department, I must do a self study in research and practice. So I want to have a solid foundation to be able to work more professionally. And I chose Kingston International College with a post grade diploma in business management online course. Uh, it fits my current lifestyle, and I feel wonderful to have a, a, a opportunity to study at a school with an uh, enthusiastic teacher. Also, uh, in our class, uh, my uh, English pronunciation is difficult to understand. Uh, sometimes I speak uh, very off topic. The teacher, but teacher very enthusiastic to listen to me and advise to me. Uh, teacher always tries uh, best to su support uh, me as a uh, friend, convey to us a lot of new knowledge and rich experience. They are very useful for uh, my job and in the future work. Students on my enthusiasm and share sharing my sharing their own experience with a whole class. One again, I want to express my gratitude to my teacher as our friend. And finally, I want to thank you to Kingston International College for organization uh of online course for us to have an opportunity to learn and get more experience. Thank you very much. Best wish for you. Thank you so much for your valedictorian speech, Noyen Ting Chen. I will now invite the Nakaran Siloban to give their speech. It seems that um, the Nakaran Siloban is uh, not able to join us tonight, so we will also proceed 
to the next valedictorian. I will now invite Shan T. Mi Doyen to give their speech. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I'm mute. Okay, uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, good evening. First of all, I would like to, uh, to express my heartfelt gratitude to my family and loved ones who have been my unwavering support system throughout my educational journey. And their, consist, um, their constant encouragement and belief in me have been instrumental in reaching this significant milestone in my life. And I would uh, also like to extend my sincere appreciation to faculty and staff in, uh, in this esteemed institution. Their dedication, their guidance, unwavering uh, commitment to excellence have shaped me into the person that I am today. And they have not only imparted knowledge, but also instilled me a passion of lifelong learning and personal growth. So reflecting upon my academic journey, I am filled with a sense of pride and uh, gratitude. And it has been a transformative experience filled with challenges and countless memories. So every late night study and weekend motivation sessions has contributed to my intellectual and personal development. And on the uh, precipice, of a new chapter, I am filled with excitement and optimism for the future. And the education and experience gained during my time here, I equip uh, me with the necessary skills and knowledge to embark the new opportunities and pursue my dreams. And I am eager to apply what I have learned and make a meaningful contribution to society. And finally, I would like to express my heartfelt uh, gratitude once again to everyone who has been a part of my educational journey. Your unwavering support, guidance, and belief in me have been uh, invaluable. So I am excited and embrace the challenges and opportunities that lie ahead with a strive to, to make a positive impact to the world. So. Uh, once again, I, I would like to say thanks to Kingston International College to organize a learning uh, environment and say thanks to all of you to being here to celebrate this milestone with me. Thank you so much. Thank you, dear valedictorians. In the words of Benjamin Franklin, an investment in knowledge always pays the best interests. And we truly believe the investment you have made will pave your path for success.
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we have one valedictorian, Tina Karan Sullivan, who managed to join us. So Tina Karan will be giving his valedictorian speech now. Ladies and gentlemen, esteemed faculty, honored guests and my incredible fellow graduates, today we stand on the brink of a new chapter, ready to embark on a journey beyond the familiar class of Kingston International College. As the valedictorian, I am honored and humbled to address you all on this momentous occasion. It is privilege to represent a class that has worked tirelessly, overcome challenges and achieved greatness. Looking back, we can see the countless hours spent in classroom, the late night studying for exam and friendship forged and the personal growth we have experienced. Each of us has a unique story, but together we share common thread of perseverance and determination. As we move forward, let's not forget the invaluable lesson we have learned within these walls beyond the academic knowledge gain. We have learned about friendship, collaboration, and the power of our community. These lessons will serve as a foundation upon which we build our futures. It's crucial to acknowledge the support we have achieved, we've received along the way. Our teachers, mentors, and families have played pivotal roles in shaping our paths. Their guidance, encouragement, and belief in our potential have fueled our journey. Let's take a moment to express our deepest gratitude to those who have stood by us to, to, to doubt this incredible adventure. In conclusion, my fellow graduates, Let's celebrate our achievement today and look forward to the limitless possibilities that follow that tomorrow holds. May your futures be bright, your dream boundless, and your impact everlasting. Thank you. Thank you for your valedictorian speech, Ina Karen Selovan. Ladies and gentlemen, a graduation ceremony is a celebration of everything it took to get here today. All the grit, the endurance, the strategies, the perseverance, the faith, and a mostly unwavering commitment to tomorrow's self. It is for life. Today, by graduating, you have earned your passport to the future. For tomorrow belongs to the people who prepare for it today. Boldly go in the direction of your dreams. Stand tall and show the world what you are made of. When the world beats you down, always find a reason to get back up again and never give up on success. navigated through challenges, 
adapted to new learning environments and demonstrated the tenacity needed to reach this milestone. Your accomplishments are not only a reflection of your intelligence, but also a testament to your character. As we gather virtually tonight, we are reminded of the power of technology to connect us across distances and bring us together in celebration. While the format may be different, the sense of pride, joy, and achievement is just as real and tangible. Today marks the end of one chapter and the beginning of another. So as you step into the next phase of your journey, armed with the knowledge and experiences gained during your time at Kingston International College, remember that you are well equipped to face the challenges and opportunities that lie ahead. Graduates, remember that time is always very precious, so don't waste it. Embrace the unknown with courage. Continue to pursue knowledge with passion and let the values instilled in you guide your actions. Your education is not just a means to an end, but a lifelong journey of learning, growth and contribution.
In closing, I request all of you to join me in a round of applause for our graduates today and for their family members and faculty who helped them reach this milestone. Congratulations, dear graduates. Now that you have graduated, be bold, be courageous, and be your best. Once again, dear graduates, congratulations. May your futures be filled with success, fulfillment, and endless possibilities. Thank you for allowing us to be part of your journey. And may this virtual celebration be a memorable and joyous occasion for all of us.
once again, ladies and gentlemen, and good night.